Hello and welcome to the 2007 Chaos Holiday Lyric Contest. So yeah, this is the first ever three Chaos family member podcast Christmas extravaganza. Hi everybody and welcome. We're joined as always by Mr. Chaos, everybody. Hello. And my very, very special doppelganger guest, Miss Kimmy Kelson. Hi all. That I'm joined on my birthday by my lovely, lovely blog wife, Holly. Hi. Sybil Law. Hey, Sybil. Hello. And my husband, Mike, the man of many names. And Megatron. And Megatron. <laughs> Am I allowed to talk yet? <laughs> You're allowed to talk now. My friend, Martin. Hello. Miss Burroughs. Delightful, too. Hi, Gunfighter. Hi, Cammy. Hi, Dr. Normal. How are you? Hello. I'm Joe Befoy. You know, I almost feel like I'm listening to a very hip national public radio or something, you know? So, do you want to tell us what Toonlit is? It's just free software tools, online tools that let anybody make their own webcomic web comic blog, um, regardless of their artistic ability. You could be like, Holodal. Wow. But if you were, you know, trying to be more authentic, it would be something more like, Holodal. <laughs> um, basically, Podcaster is an iPhone web app, and uh, I created it for uh, being, you know, so I was able to stream some of my favorite podcasts to my iPhone without having to sync with iTunes. And this week's guest is the one and only Aaron Hockley. And thank goodness there's only one. <laughs> we decided to have him come on the show to talk to all of you about WordCamp Portland. What you're saying is I could be a Twitter whore and a friend feed snob and everything would be okay. Yep. I'm going to try it. It's fun. All right. Yeah. I think we need to talk about why you're obsessed with unicorns instead of Pegasus? Uh, instead of what? Instead of a Pegasus. It uh, uh, wasn't what you said. It, uh, what, unicorns or what? Why are yeah, you so obsessed with unicorns instead of Pegasus? There's no audio or video going on Eastern right now. Yeah, you're, you've dropped. Are we that. totally screwed? Yeah, it's just playing that old one where you got the Crocs up on the <laughs> table. It's too good when nothing happened at the beginning, like when everything was really smooth. Sweet! Okay. I don't mean to be antagonistic. I just mean to say that it's really hard to say Pegasus. This is horrible. I'm trying to get to say Pegasus. Pegasus. Is it time? It's sure. time. On tech, we're bringing out the whiteboard. So Twitter says, okay, well, let me check with should Cammy they, Chaos. Shouldn't there be a little arrow that goes? Yeah, I suppose there probably should. Okay, hang on here. Eat it. Absolutely, Cammy. Okay. Camera guy, are you with him? I can tap on the side, and then when I'm in review mode, I can scroll through the pictures as well, just by tapping on the left, tapping on the right, and then confirming up above. He has an awesome little blinky light. What is it doing? It's sending a message. What is the message? I can't say. You have to, oh, uh, that's uh, for you to uh, study and find out. Morse code? It is Morse code. I was lucky enough to be in the group with Jack Dorsey, the inventor of Twitter, mm -hmm. when he described the idea for the first time. And he talked about a service that would keep us connected no matter where we were uh, uh, and share the status of, of what we were doing, wherever we were. Me, all the buttons, all the work. Oh, this is my iPhone running the show. Running the show. That's so it's naked women, Star Wars figures, and prostates. I think that's a, that's a podcast if I ever heard one. But don't want to see how the sausage was made, people. Yeah. Not no. all of it. I like sausage. <laughs> I'd like to continue to have the sausage. Okie dokie. <laughs> get right on that. And I dominate Google search for Dave Man 692. She presently looks like a Jawa. <laughs> I commend you all to uh, come and come and see this. One at a time, please. What the fuck is a whoopee? <laughs> yeah, it's uh, it is a kind of a fun, uh, kind of strange word. And the fryer was turned on, and I walked over with the fryer, and I was like, you know what I mean? This is what we're gonna do. And I drove the thing in the fryer, and he's like, I don't think this is a good idea. And I was like, we had eaten like a whole 
you know, at that point we had eaten a whole bunch with his staff. Is the keynote on making stuff? It is on yeah. making stuff, yeah. I haven't really been that much of a maker myself, so I felt kind of like a fraud, you know? Do any of the others use hashtags to make um, their point? <laughs> not as much. Shows like Strange Love Live and the community that you guys build with people tuning in live to watch and chat. Our current guest, Will Norris. Yeah, okay. Um, Will Norris actually has no affiliation with Sambor Camp whatsoever. <laughs> this is this is my cam. That's well, you have a bar, see? It's on There's a bar here? Josh, you're supposed to be wearing the helmet cam. Whoa. That's a helmet cam yeah, foul. Yeah, but then All they right. might have to get some uncomfortable closeness going well, on. Well, then he can say, hey, that's I my I have to cam. work with this guy. It's a, whole new, it's a whole new thing. Yeah, Apparently come on, professionals man. professionals are not often asked to turn the camera on themselves, on their forearms. <laughs> Strange Love Live is the best place to meet tech personalities in Portland without actually meeting them. So watch it Friday nights at 8 or 9. Okay.